NASCAR Nation, I'm Courtney Hansen here at the State of the Art Stuart Haas Race Shop. The saying goes, you win and lose races in the shop. Well, that holds true in more ways than one for this team. They have a great asset that makes them the envy of the competition. It may not look like much, but many races have been won right here. Let me explain. Back when NASCAR first started, the setup of the car was extremely basic and was considered an afterthought as teams relied on their driver's skills. As years went by, folks realized making adjustments to the car itself could make a huge difference. But they were never able to test those changes until they got to the racetrack. That is, until the seven post shaker rig was invented. I'm here with Stuart Haas competition director, Greg Zipidelli. Greg, what's the seven post? Well, it's this rig that we put the race car on. We put uh, inputs from the racetrack, uh, we make a track map, and we can actually run the car through a lap at the racetrack. The wheels will move up and down at the frequencies that the race car will actually see on the racetrack, and um, it allows us to, uh, to tune in our car, try some things, validate our simulation, um, and prepare for our race weekend. What tracks is it most beneficial to you? I mean, it works at a lot of racetracks. We, we take, for instance, the short tracks and really concentrate on the grip. Um, more of the tire and air to the racetrack. It uh, also is very valuable at places like uh, Charlotte, Dover, Kansas, the bigger places where grid um, and aero platform are extremely important. How does having it here in the shop benefit you on race weekends? Well, for us, it, it, it allows us to unload um, better at the racetrack, and hopefully it um, speeds up our changes. Like, we can make um, some extra runs because we've got a little data to look at, um, which is hopefully better than our competition. Well, thanks, Greg. This was a pleasure. Anytime. I appreciate you having me. Stay tuned to NASCAR.com for even more of the inside scoop on automotive technology.